guys, welcome back. Today we are going to be talking about how you can dress when you are bloated. This video is not meant to cause offense. I'm not trying to say that bloating is bad or anything like that. It's just that for me personally, I can find that when I am feeling bloated, my clothes can feel really uncomfortable and sometimes even painful because they feel like they're really digging in. I hope this isn't TMI, but over the last couple of years I've been getting some new and different symptoms when I get my period. And one of the symptoms that I now have that I never used to have is bloating. So last year I was struggling to dress appropriately for work when I was on my period because all of my work trousers felt really tight and restrictive and they were just really cutting into my stomach. So I found a few clothing tips that have helped me and I wanted to share them with you today and hopefully they help you as well. If you are new here, I'd love it if you subscribe. I upload a new video every single week and let's go ahead and get into the first tip. Tip number one is to wear items with a stretchy waistband rather than a rigid one or one with not a lot of stretch. So a lot of work trousers I find are very rigid and structured, which is great when you're not bloated, but when you are bloated, they are the ones that really cut into your stomach and I find them super uncomfortable to wear when I'm on my period. So this year I've been all about trousers with stretchy waistbands. They have an elasticated waistband. The looser, the better, honestly. As long as they're still tight enough to stay up, they are more comfortable the looser they are. My favorite for this is my Colottes from Cotton On. They have a stretchy waistband, but the trousers themselves are also really loose and flowy, so they also just flow over any bloating that you have so that it's not visible to other people and they're just such a loose fit that no one's gonna see the bloating and it means that your stomach is really comfortable and not feeling squished. Tip number two is where your waistband sits on your stomach. So I find that a high-rise or mid-rise waistband is so much more flattering and so much more comfortable than a low-rise waistband. If your trousers are coming up to exactly where your bloating is, which for me is the lower part of my stomach, so like low-rise jeans or low-rise trousers, it's just cutting into exactly where all of the bloat is. A, super uncomfortable. B, it really emphasizes the area and kind of makes you look bigger than you need to look. So what I prefer to do instead is wear mid or high rise trousers or jeans. And then if the waistband is still digging in a little bit, then at least it's not exactly where the bloat is, so it's not quite as uncomfortable. And B, it is covering up all of the problem area, which is so much more flattering. Once again, my collots from Cotton On are perfect for this because they are high rise, so they cater to both tips. But I also love, and the one that you'll see pictured is my jeans from Cotton On. They cover up all of the bloating area. And they are like half a size bigger than my other jeans. So that as well just means that there's just a tiny bit more space in them and they're way more comfortable. Tip number three is to wear dark colors. This tip obviously is not so much about feeling comfortable, it's more about the way that it looks. If you're not someone that worries about how bloating looks, then just ignore this tip, you do you. But if you are feeling like the bloating is making you look a little bigger than you want to look, and you just wanna look like you do when you're not bloated, then this tip can be helpful as well. So light colors are gonna draw more attention. It's the same with makeup. You put highlight on the features that you want to bring out and you put contour on the features that you want to look smaller. It's just the same thing. So if you wear light colors, you're gonna draw attention. If you wear dark colors, it's gonna cover it up a little bit more. And also because dark colors, you can't really see the shadows so much. So even if you're wearing tight, dark clothing, it's still just not going to be as noticeable that you've got some bloating going on. Tip number four is all about dresses because honestly, when I'm on my period and I'm feeling bloated, I don't want anything gripping to my stomach, so most of the time I will choose to go for a dress instead of trousers at all. Yes, even in winter I just get some really thick warm stockings. But anyway, even with dresses you can be more or less comfortable depending on the dress that you go for. So my advice for dresses is to avoid ones with a really tight waistband or ones that have a belt that you tie around the waist. Normally these are my favorite types of dresses to wear because I've got quite a small waist, so if I draw attention to that it just makes me look smaller. But when I'm bloated, obviously my waist is not so small. So A, the dresses feel tighter, which is not comfortable, and B, they don't make me look as small as I would when I'm not bloated. Because it's no longer drawing attention to a small part of my body, it's now drawing attention to a slightly larger part of my body. My advice is just not to go for those dresses, but instead go for looser fitting dresses that don't have such 
a tight waistband or even the dresses that are quite structured. Just go for the looser fitting flowy dresses. I find with dresses with quite a tight waistband and the one that I'm showing you is from Pagani with this beautiful red belt, which normally I love by the way. But anyway, if I wear this when I'm feeling bloated, it cinches in at my waist like I've said, but then my bloating is like just under my waist. So it kind of creates this puff effect underneath the belt. Yeah, it just makes it look really bad. But if I wear a dress with a little less structure, one that's just a bit more flowy and loose, then it really isn't gripping to anything. So it looks like you're not bloated at all and it feels way more comfortable. The final tip is to do with the jumper that you put on top of whatever else you're wearing. My advice here is not to go for a tight jumper, but instead to go for a cardigan. If you wear a tight jumper, it's just going to cling to everything and it's going to show exactly where your stomach is and how bloated it is. If you wear a cardigan, especially like a lovely, loose, maybe even oversized cardigan, then you're not going to be able to see you're bloating at all. I love this because cardigans are gonna keep you just as warm as a jumper, but because they just drop down the sides, you can't see from the side on that you have a bit of a belly going on. Again, this is a tip that applies more if you care what you look like. It's not so much gonna make you feel any more comfortable, but it's just another one that I use when I'm feeling a bit iffy about how I look when I'm bloated. So those are my five tips on how to dress when you're bloated. If you have any other tips, please leave them down below so we can all get ideas. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you found it helpful and I will see you again next time. Bye.